the button, you press it, and it switches, it switches on. This doesn't impact your sight. It tunes the way your brain works. It has, a certain, no, seriously, it's a matter of, dyslexia happens in the visual cortex at the back of your head, yeah. and there is some crowding that appears, you know, on the left. It's crowded, it's very difficult to read. These glasses, they erase the crowding and makes it very simple. Wow. How did you come up with this? There was a scientific discovery, academic research, uh, in 2017 that was awarded by the French National Academy of Medicine. And since then, we've been working together. We did R&D and took us three years of R&D to design and engineer the glasses, for which we got an award in 2020. And this year, we're back with the screen, computer screen, that embeds the same technology, but natively. That is, you don't need an additional device. You look at the device and you can read instantly. Over the past two days, we had several gentlemen passing by and saying, that's something weird, I can read. I, I'm, usually I can't, and here on the screen I can. And that's what it does. It, it just removes the internal crowding, so you can not only can you read more easily, but also you understand as you read. And do you have dyslexia? Like, how, why do you care about this problem? How did you get into this? Oh, uh, I don't have this. I have many other problems with my eyes, but I don't have dyslexia. But uh, actually, I'm a geek. Uh, I'm an entrepreneur. And I discovered this uh, academic research discovery in the newspapers. Uh, there were two lines, but very humble. But I saw the potential. I contacted the researchers, and we've been working together since then. And is this available for consumers? You have to have a prescription? How do you get this? It is available to consumers through Lexilens.com. We ship worldwide. During the CES, there is an offer, 20% off. And we offer, that's the most important, we offer a 30-day money-back guarantee. That is, people can try it at home for 30 days. If they're not satisfied, they return it, and we refund. No problem, no question asked. But you can, this can be adjusted to your site with prescription lenses and for which, of course, you need an optician. But um, today we are selling to consumers directly and we are looking for partners, of course. And the, the screen, is it integrated into laptops or is this just a, a demo, a prototype? This is a prototype. We are launching production soon and we also have the patent for laptops and smartphones. Wow. And you have a patent for the glasses as well? Of course. Of course. Very nice. Very cool. How long have you been working on this, you said? Oh, six years now. Six years. It's pretty incredible. Do you have like a lot of success stories, people coming and saying, you've changed my life? Oh, yeah, exactly. Exactly. You know the latest one? It's a grand grandmother. She wrote a letter to us. She said, my, my granddaughter dreamt about becoming a nurse. You know, that was her dream. But she quit because she thought she, she was unable, she was like uh, uh, unable to do it. Since she has your glasses, she resumed her, st uh, her studies and now she's becoming a nurse. She's fulfilling her potential and her dream. But, you know, yes. And we have so many stories like this, very emotional. And people tell us, you changed my life. You know, because dyslexia is way beyond simply reading because it has an impact also on how you socialize, how you project yourself in the future, how you feel included in the society. And that's the issue. If you feel excluded at some point, uh, you stop making efforts and you end up making uh, crazy things like ending in prison. And what is it like being a founder in France? It's... Uh, a tech founder in France. Well, it's nice. Uh, yeah. yeah, it's nice. I'm very proud because proud. for the first time in my life, I'm doing things that have meaning. Yeah. You know, I bring joy to people, and this is our goal. Our mission, actually, is to make this technology available to uh, the, the most people. I mean, the, 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 the largest number of people. Is your team like based in France mostly? Is it remote? How do you guys work? We are based in France, and we are in the process of establishing in the U.S. as well. So we have uh, uh, underway, we have a clinical trial that will enable us to get FDA approved and then establish in the US. Wow. So FDA approval is important to you have to it, it. Yes, it is. Yeah. Yes. Oh, so this is like a real medical device. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yes. Is there any downside to it or is there any like that people don't like technology near their heads or anything? Is there any concern or no? No, 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 no concern. The only thing is, uh, it is we do not recommend it to people uh, sensitive to seizure. Why is that? 
Well, because of the functioning. I mean, there is some flickering. And uh, although we are far from the range uh, that can cause seizure, just to be sure, we, we don't recommend. What happens if I put this on to someone that doesn't have dyslexia? Nothing. You, Nothing. You're trying. You, 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 yeah, you won't notice any difference. Wow. Someone that does, does. What, what is the technology doing? Can you like explain it to me in like yeah. basic terms? Yeah, yeah for sure. Like, Basically, when you turn it on, the active lenses, they hash the light, and by hashing the light, like you're flickering, kind of, these send waves uh, uh, to, uh, to, to your brain, instructions. And so it disables a part of the uh, one process that causes the crowding, internal crowding. So basically, this is the way we erase the crowd. That's crazy. And there's no way of solving dyslexia. It's like you live with this forever, right? There's no other other treatments for it? Like, do you compete with anything or no? Yes. We have an increasing number of people telling us that they need less and less the, the, the glasses. But this, we don't, we, we don't know yet. You don't know yet. But maybe someday the research could show you guys are solving maybe, this. Maybe. Maybe, hopefully, yeah. Very cool. Well, Michael, thank you so much for speaking with me and taking the time to tell me all about what you built. It's pretty incredible. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Thank you for the great work you do.